what is up Matthew 6464 here and today we're gonna be doing a um, DIY bubblegum making kit so um shout outs to my auntie she sent this to me all the way from Victoria and we're gonna be testing it trying it out and just using it so if you guys are wondering where I am I am uh, my cabin I will be doing another vlog at this just my cabin so I will do a vlog I'll show you guys what that looks like if you guys are curious and um yeah so we are gonna get into this sorry that the footage is so terrible I'm getting my new camera coming in currently I'm just using my iPad I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get the um Sony forget what it's called but a Sony camera so that's what I'm gonna be getting and um we're gonna also do a little twist we're gonna use this and I'm going to try and melt up some of these Sour Patches, Sour Patch Kids, and make a Sour Patch flavor. So I guess, um, yeah, on to the video. Okay, so, um, I got the gum kit, and, um, I'm going to try to open this. Sorry if my head isn't fully in the video. <laughs> I'm currently kind of kneeling because I'm in my kitchen counter, but it's a bit too low, but, um, Inside here, I have the whole box, we have wax paper, I think, a cup, a little popsicle stir stick thingy, the instructions, and a bag of stuff. Okay, so we're going to start off by opening this bag. Um, let's see. Oh, by the way, guys, remember to be... Smash that like button, leave a like and subscribe. Um, tell me guys how you like the new banner that I took a long time. I stay up till like 2 a.m. working on that, so yeah. That took a long time. So in here, I think that's like gum base. Pretty sure, you know, I'm actually just gonna try one out. I'm pretty sure this is like unflavored gum. See that? And, uh, um, it has a consistency of gum, but it's like just not gum flavored, so just put that over there. Um, I'm pretty sure we got this gel like substance, probably like corn syrup or something like that. I'm pretty sure this is the flavoring and a bunch of powdered sugar. So I'm going to start off opening the um, Sour Patch Kids just gonna rip that there we go and it's a full pack of sour patches um see got all the colors I'm just gonna try one my favorite's the blue so that should be good um so yeah I guess we're gonna um read the instructions so those are the instructions so I'm just gonna read it sorry about that so it says unfold the wax paper pour half the powdered sugar empty the gum packet into the stirring bowl add the flavoring in the corn syrup microwave until it's melted pour it into the sugar and then um Mix it with the tool until it's mixed, and then add powdered sugar, and then wrap it. So I guess um, let's see. Yeah, step number one is taking your wax paper and um, unfolding it. I'm not going to use all of it. I'm just going to use a little bit less. I'm just going to trim off a bit so maybe we can wrap some on the wax paper later. Okay, good. We got our wax paper. And now we have our powdered sugar. So this is where stuff gets a little bit messy. We're going to pour half of this on the wax paper. It says make a mountain. Now I'm going to try this. 
Yeah, it tastes like um icing sugar. Um, we still need more. Let's just pour about half the bag. I think we got a pretty decent amount. And now I'm just gonna flatten it down. Sorry if you guys can't really see, I know the lighting's very light. Um, it's very bright. So, just gonna mold that a bit. There we go. I'm going to move that off to the side. I've got the cup and the next part in the instructions, which I will show you, is I think, I'm not sure what step we're on. I don't know. It um, says, I'm just going to read this up here, down here. It says, um, empty the powdered sugar into there, add the gum flavor and the syrup. Okay. Um the gum is over here. Let's we got the gum. Um and now we're gonna pour it in. It seems very solid. Uh it's not coming out, it's like hard as a rock. So I just whacked it a few times and now it should come out. Yeah, there we go. We got our gum. Um, it says to add the corn syrup and the flavoring. So we're going to add our corn syrup. And actually, you know, we're not going to use all of this because um, we're going to divide it half and half and try to use some of the sour patch. Okay, so I got a little mixing cup too. So we're going to take, we got our gum here inside the cup. Just gonna pour it on the counter, and I guess we're gonna divide it pretty evenly. Um, that should be good. Probably gonna put a little bit more onto the um, regular side because I don't know if this is gonna work at all. So we're just gonna grab our gum, put the gum in here, and the rest of the gum we're gonna put in the clear glass. Uh, there we go. And we got some in here, some in here. So it says add your um, your corn syrup. So we're gonna put half in here, a half in here. Um, I guess I'm just gonna cut right along the top. Uh, Very sweet. Yeah. Doesn't really taste that good. Um, so I'm going to put a lot in here. See, it's coming out of the bag. It's very sticky. Like, very sticky. gonna try get that down get off gonna add quite a bit more of this stuff in the bowl and then we're just gonna dump that in there there we go put that to the side and now we're going to use the rest in um, this one. So we're going to try to get all the corn syrup out into this. So you guys, I know this takes a little bit of time. So I'm just going to put the corn syrup in and put the flavoring okay, in. Okay, so um, I got the um, corn syrup in here, which was a very messy and sticky thing. And now we got it in here. See, it's holding most of the gum in, except for a few pieces. My hands are like full of stickiness. 
and now we're gonna add the flavoring to this one. I'm gonna grab the stick. Put it there. We're gonna get cut the thing. And we're gonna add all the flavoring into here. Should be good. And it doesn't actually say what the flavoring is, so I'm just gonna a bit of powder. I think it's like classic pink. And that is the corn syrup bag. I think it's like the pink bubblegum kind of thing. Um, I'm also going to put food coloring in here later. But now, for this, we're going to, for the Sour Patch one, dump all of it. And I'm only going to pick out pretty much the reds because I only have red food coloring so I think it'll look best and it'll be good so we're gonna pour a few more on the ground so if you guys can't see that just use the reds got one more red here maybe I'm gonna toss in a few oranges and then put the rest back in the bag there we go um, now we got our red and oranges, and we're going to put them in this gum mix. Here we go. Now we got pretty much two, the powder, and this. And we're going to read the instructions. So it says put them in the microwave for 5 to 10 interval seconds until melted. Okay, so once it's melted, I will see you guys then. Hey guys, um, so I just finished up with the microwave stuff, so um, I'm just going to move my cloth over there, move the corn syrup pile, and we are going to take back this. So I made it into two different piles, you see, stick my thing right through there, and I got that. Um, we got two different piles, I made a little hole in the middle, like it is advertised. I just got my microwave right next to me. And everything is steaming, boiling hot. I need to make bigger piles. Um, we're gonna start off with the regular one first. That is what it looks like. It is extremely hot, so I'm using just a glove. Well, I should probably use this. It is very hot, yeah. Um, we're just going to take it and we're going to pour it in uh, this one. Oh wow! It didn't mix thoroughly. Okay. Um, look, here I'll, I'll, t I'll show you guys. See? It didn't mix properly. So we're going to put that, I guess, back in the microwave. And we're going to set it for, well, I'm actually going to try the other one. And we're going to set it for another okay, 20 seconds. Okay, so um, I just microwaved them. Again, make sure they are fully, like, working and they are um, good. So we're going to start by pouring the regular one, which for some reason doesn't look, like, the best. The Sour Patch one actually looks like it works better. So we're just going to pour the candy gum into the thing. Great. Uh, yeah, I guess. Now we're just going to start mixing this one. Is it hot? Yes. So I'm going to coat... Ah, it's so hot. It's like unbelievably hot. Um, so we're just gonna mix it, I guess, with the um, stir thing. And you're supposed to mix it in powdered sugar, as you guys can see. Um, it's not really working that well. Um, 
Yeah, I guess. I kind of was expecting a bit better than this. I can probably use my hands now. Guys, um, that is our gum. Or it says keep mixing. I don't see what there is to mix. It just pretty much all evaporated. So, um, yeah, I guess. I, I really don't know what the thumbnail is going to be for this video. Um, because there's no, not really much. That's one gumball. Uh, leave that there. Can probably make one more small one, maybe. Yeah, got one more small one. Now we can just um, grab this star patch one, and we're gonna grab our star stick, and we're gonna pour the star patch in. Here we go. I'm totally missing. I don't know why there's more Sour Patch. Like there's a lot more Sour Patch. I, I don't know why, honestly. So um, I'm just gonna mix this, I guess, behind the scenes and then. Okay, so um, I got the gum all molded. I um just rinsed them under water to wash off all the powdered sugar. The two brighter ones are the um, regular, and the three darker ones are the Sour Patch. So I'm gonna try the regular one first. Three, two, one. Um. Uh, uh. Taste burnt. Um, guess I'm gonna try one of these then. Um, I don't like any of them. Broken half. Um, I honestly prefer the gum base, like the first one. Remember, in the start of the video, I just tried a little piece of the plain tasting gum. I prefer that. Um, eh, no. Wow, I'm just eating powdered sugar. Um, I thought that'd be better. Um, I'm pretty disappointed. I'm pretty sure that kit costs like twenty dollars. You can go out and buy two big tubs of Hubba Bubba or Double Bubble, I think, like for like this big for ten bucks. So your choice. But personally, this um, I wouldn't go out and buy it ever. Um, it's called Do It Yourself Bubblegum Workshop. See? There you go. That's what it's called. That's what it's called. And, um, yeah. Hope you guys kind of enjoyed this video. Um, please leave a like and subscribe. Hit that bell icon down below. And, um, yeah. See you in the next video. Bye!